my channel Sky Lexis. Woohoo! Don't forget to subscribe, comment, like, and share. Okay, guys. So ah! I'm out of the ranch, guys. <laughs> because it's Saturday time. It's weekend. Uh, we are in the car, guys, with my friends because we're going to watch the most phenomenal movie in the entire uh, decade, which is the John Wick. Rawr! I love Keanu Reeves. He's one of the famous actor in the whole Hollywood. I like, I like him. He's the best in terms of acting. It's so good. So, guys, I want to introduce you my friends in here. Uh, what can you say my friend can you say your voice but actually guys she don't she's a very private person so we can only hear her voice okay hi my friend can say hi to my subscribers hi guys <laughs> that's it it's very very a big huge voice my goodness guys so guys we have to def to tackle a differences about a Filipino and a British citizen which is England so I'm a Filipino in here guys and my friend is a British uh, citizen so that's the, we have to tackle the differences what is the culture, the food and the technologies in here and work as well so my friends <laughs> are you ready to have the differences since guys my friends as well she visited in Philippines as well and what can you say the Philippines my friend I like Philippines mm -hmm. um, it's nice for okay. a holiday uh -huh. um, the weather is really really beautiful because of the warm climate okay, I yeah. really really enjoy the beaches mm -hmm. they're I think one of the best in the world because uh -huh. I've, I've traveled to other countries as well uh -huh. but my number one beach spot I have to definitely say is the Philippines. Okay. Um, in the UK, oh, the there is there is some really nice spots to visit as well. Mm -hmm. but, but the problem here is the weather. You can never predict the weather in the UK. Um, in one day, you can have four seasons already. That's true. That's true. You can have you know rain. Yeah. It can be windy. That's true. It can be um, snowing all in one so that's that's the problem however there are some really good and cool spots in um, the UK as well so if you want like scenic um, places mm -hmm. uh, you can go down to Cornwall oh. and I, I really enjoy Cornwall but it's the weather that is probably the letdown here mm -hmm. um, in terms of the beaches here we do have <laughs> okay, yeah. a fair few but yeah. they're not on the scale of what Philippines and I uh, so that, that's a bit of a letdown. So that's that's the biggest thing which is in, in the Philippines is the beaches is really really good isn't it that's, that's and also correct. the weather as well is like just because our uh, climate in the Philippines we have we have only two seasons like the rainy seasons and the summer so uh, that's the only and also the typhoon one that's it's our you know downside I'm not I'm not experienced the typhoon thank you <laughs> for that. But um, yeah. I have I have experienced the rainy sort of season. Uh -huh. um, however, the thing is that the rain comes down and the next minute is clear. Clear, yeah. Because of the hot hot climate, so but it's, in you here don't, you don't feel it. But in here is that's the biggest difference in here because in one day, as you said, it's already four season. We already experience in a day, right? Uh, absolutely. And the thing is, I think. England has a lot of history okay, yeah. in terms of the different castles, mm -hmm. the different, you know, um, we can say the royal family yeah. and how they've evolved That's over a sort of time. Mm -hmm. Whereas um, the Philippines, I know there is history there, mm -hmm. um, but it's primarily probably like um, Manila and other other parts mm -hmm. where like you know the Spanish may have ruled yeah Spanish yeah, yeah. So, because we're colonized with the Spanish so that's why yeah so so that that I've seen like bits of it in Manila mm -hmm. but here there's a lot more history to kind of learn and I think a lot of people tourists come here to learn learn about the history mm -hmm. and um, yeah London, London is amazing for I think shopping 
So yeah. if, you, if you like shopping, me, I'm not a massive person who a likes shopping. To, yeah, but shop. and how about the the biggest difference as well in here is like the work, right? Because in the Philippines, in a day, that's our um, a day to work to have to pay our wages only per day we pay in here. Oh, so um, you want to talk a bit about the yeah work. about the so, work because so here mm -hmm. you have to work eight hours a day. Um, so maximum I think it's like 37 to 40 hours okay. you're allowed to work full time mm -hmm. legally however um, there is you can you can opt in to work more as well mm -hmm. but it's usually capped at 40 hours 40 hours yeah that's a bit um, because of the, the, ca the, the tax as well right yeah, this, this, the tax. This, this, yeah. This so that's why guys that's the big difference in here and also in here they pay us per hour right they yeah, pay per get, hour. You get paid per oh. hour. And they got the long days, guys. Not compare out to the Philippines that we only... There's, there's two, there's two um, types. So mm. you can have a, you know, it's based on contracts. Okay. So for me, um, I'm on a contract of 37 hours. Oh. So I have to finish my work within that time. With that. If I work extra yeah. to do to finish my, you know, work, oh. then I only get paid for 37 hours. Oh. Right. I so see. other other people like uh, people working in the shops, for example. Oh yeah, yeah. Or, I see. They get it. Um, yeah, yeah. Like, you know, as as a caregiver. Yeah. Um, they have an hourly rate. Hourly rate. Yeah, that's true. Um, and then, mm. then they can work. You work. know, uh, whatever. Whatever. But then you get you get taxed. Mm. So I think tax free at the moment. Don't quote me on this. Guys. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's probably about twelve thousand. 800 at the minute oh, and then after that high, yeah. you start getting taxed a lot of people um, if you're working full time yeah. do hit that bracket yeah. um, and that's why um, everybody's like complaining that you know and the more you earn the more you get taxed yeah that's so true so that's why a lot that's, of people tend true. to kind of complain, complain more, yeah. more that tax is obviously then used by the government to have you know we've got NHS which is free mm. for citizens for this, yes yeah. Um, we've got um, free state schools yeah. again for citizens and children. Mm. Citizens. Wow! Imagine, um, guys, what if it, they apply it in the Philippines, right? Oh my God! But we still, uh, you know, behind with them. So that's all I can say. So, mate, that's the biggest difference in our because, right there in the Philippines, if we work like a like a horse, but the pay, as you know, is very low. Yeah, so yeah, the, the pound goes a big way in the Philippines, mm. and I, I feel like I'm super rich when, <laughs> when I was in the Philippines. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because like even if you have, yeah. like you know, um, sure. yeah, a small, yeah. small amount, small just, amount yeah. say one thousand pounds. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna give an example. Yeah, exactly. You have a thousand pounds is equivalent to I think the rate kind of fluctuates for mm. say sixty-seven thousand. Yes, yeah, yes, yeah. yeah, and. That's a lot of money mm. in the Philippines. True. You can do a lot of things with that. Yeah. And you can comfortably, like, kind of live on a standard, standard person's, like, you know, a normal. Um, I don't know how to kind of describe it, but like, yeah. uh, you know, a person who's living in the Philippines. Yeah. Uh, but not, not too, like, you know, high end. Yeah. Oh, that's, yeah. that's quite comfortable, ain't it? That's yes. Quite yes. A yes. Big, Big amount, sixty-seven thousand. You can probably explain mm -hmm. what you can kind of get with sixty thousand. Yeah, it's a big, it's a big amount already. To be so honest, just, guys. Just explain to the people. Like, yeah. What What can you get with sixty thousand pesos? Sixty thousand in our country already. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a lot. So just Just explain, like, what What kind of things can you buy? Can My you God. Buy groceries. Can we you can. Pay the we rent? can buy. Yeah. We already buy the rent. Imagine the monthly wages. I mean, I'm so not well, the wages. I mean, the monthly bills that we able to pay because mostly probably, example because me I already living in the Philippines. I'm only alone, so the electric that I need to pay is around two thousand pounds. So I can buy the grocery for the whole month already for that as well. So sixty thousand, maybe I got an extra thirty thousand savings. If so only a loan person. I think you confused everybody because you said two thousand pounds. What do you mean? You said two thousand pounds is two thousand pesos. How you say? No, two thousand. No, sorry, two thousand pesos, guys. For their bills, 
but it really depends though because some like for me like I do only one people and not some other families as well there are lots of people so that's maybe the business might make difference right because some are middle class some are poor you know what I mean Ta -da! sorry guys I've been cut off earlier because my phone is slow but <laughs> I just got home as well guys such an interesting day today so anyway guys as you remember earlier me and my friend having a discussion regarding the differences in here in the uk and in the philippines right guys <laughs> yes guys uh we tackled a lot of discussion earlier so if you want to know more guys just comment down below if you want to know more the life in here in uk and you if you want to compare the differences as well in here in uk and in the philippines just let me know and comment down below so that we can arrange regarding with that okay <laughs> i'm so really really you know when we discussed that earlier guys oh my goodness has been like oh this is a good one right so at least you know already what is really live in here okay guys so anyway guys uh i've just i've finished already watching the john wick the four and yeah oh my goodness guys it's a brilliant movie and a breathtaking movie and it's a thrill actions like that guys oh my goodness i've been speechless i want to shout but i can't really shout in there because people are very quiet and also their cinema guys is so big and they have the recliner chair and you can lie down and watching the very cinematic you know uh, big screen in there and the Dolby is the sounds is really amazing guys oh my goodness if if I rate that movie guys it's gonna be 10 it's a very nice movie I can't recommend it that to you you need to watch it guys you really need to watch it okay uh, I don't want to spoil it really guys I will maybe I will make another video for that regarding the reaction of Gen Week okay but for now I just want to know only the highlights of what really happened but yeah it's a very interesting and very very thinking your mind's gonna be blown away it's all action guys this is all action this is G -G -G -G. oh my goodness it's really I have so much fun in the cinema and anyway guys it's already evening and we need to wrap up it now okay and guys don't forget to subscribe my youtube channel Skylexis. don't forget to subscribe comment and like until next time bye